Daycare injuries can leave lasting scars that aren't just physical. Children may experience a range of psychological and emotional challenges as they navigate the aftermath of a daycare injury. Let's discuss five coping mechanisms children may revert to after a daycare injury and the signs parents should look for. The first coping mechanism is regression. Children may exhibit regression in their developmental milestones, such as potty training and speech, reverting to earlier stages as a coping mechanism. This regression can manifest in behaviors like speaking in baby talk or bedwetting. This serves as a way for children to seek comfort and security in the face of trauma. The second coping mechanism is avoidance. Children may avoid activities, places, or people associated with the daycare injury. This avoidance stems from fear and anxiety about experiencing a similar traumatic event again. The third coping mechanism is aggression. Some children may display aggressive behaviors, such as hitting, biting, or yelling. This aggression is often a manifestation of pent-up frustration, anger, or confusion resulting from the daycare injury. The fourth coping mechanism is withdrawal. Children may withdraw from social interactions, preferring to spend time alone or with a few trusted individuals. This withdrawal serves as a protective mechanism to shield themselves from further harm or perceived threats. Lastly, the fifth coping mechanism is hypervigilance. Children may become hyper aware of their surroundings, constantly scanning for potential dangers or triggers. This hypervigilance is a response to heightened anxiety and a desire to maintain control in uncertain situations. It's essential for parents and caregivers to recognize these coping mechanisms and provide appropriate support to help children heal from daycare injuries. Seeking therapy or other psychological help is crucial for children who have experienced daycare injuries. Professional therapists can provide specialized support to help children process their emotions, develop coping strategies, and build resilience in the face of trauma. If your child is suffering from the psychological trauma associated with a daycare injury, don't hesitate to contact us. At The Button Law Firm, we're here to help you understand your legal options and advocate for your child's rights. If you have more questions about possible psychological injuries and the next steps to take, but aren't ready to talk to us just yet, we understand. We've created a free five-step guide on what to do after a daycare injury. It's linked below. We're here to keep you and your family moving forward.